Sure, here's a simple recipe for making jalebi, a popular Indian sweet. Ingredients For the batter 1. 1 cup all-purpose flour 2. 1 tablespoon chickpea flour, besan 3. 1 half teaspoon turmeric powder, for color 4. 1 half teaspoon baking powder 5. 1 tablespoon yogurt 6. Water, as needed, to make a thick batter 7. A pinch of saffron strands, optional, for color For the sugar syrup 1. 1 cup sugar 2. 1 half cup water 3. 1 half teaspoon cardamom powder 4. A few saffron strands Oil or ghee for frying Instructions Prepare the batter 1. In a mixing bowl, combine the all-purpose flour, chickpea flour, turmeric powder, baking powder, and saffron strands, if using. 2. Add yogurt and a little water at a time to make a thick batter. 2. Mix well to ensure there are no lumps. 2. The batter should be smooth and slightly thick. 2. Allow it to rest for 15-20 minutes. Prepare the sugar syrup. 1. In a saucepan, combine sugar and water. 1. Heat over medium heat until the sugar dissolves completely. 2. Add cardamom powder and saffron strands to the sugar syrup. 3. Let the syrup simmer for about 5-7 minutes until it reaches a slightly sticky consistency. 3. It doesn't need to be too thick. 3. Turn off the heat and set the syrup aside. Frying the jalebis. 1. Heat oil or ghee in a deep frying pan over medium heat. 1. Make sure the oil is not too hot. 2. Pour the jalebi batter into a squeeze bottle or a piping bag with a small round tip. 2. You can also use a plastic Ziploc bag and snip off a small corner. 3. Squeeze the batter into the hot oil in a spiral or pretzel-like shape. 3. Start from the center and work your way outwards. 3. Fry a few jalebis at a time, depending on the size of your pan. Frying and soaking. 1. Fry the jalebis until they are golden and crisp on both sides. 1. They should be cooked but not overly dark. 2. Remove the fried jalebis from the oil and immediately dip them into the warm sugar syrup. 2. Let them soak for about a minute, then flip them over and soak for another minute. Serve. 1. Remove the jalebis from the syrup and place them on a plate. 1. They will be syrupy and sticky. 2. Allow the jalebis to cool slightly before serving. 2. You can garnish them with chopped nuts if desired. Jalebis are best enjoyed when they are fresh and still slightly warm. They have a crispy exterior and a syrupy interior, making them a delightful Indian dessert.